Here's an excerpt from Monday Night's live stream. Kevin C. Smith. How you doing, Kevin? From the DCC++ EX Dev Team. Glad to see you in here. I was just going to talk about DCC++ EX in a little bit. <laughs> this was about two years ago when... Uh, I don't want to give it away. <laughs> okay, but we'll talk about that in a little bit. What do we we got here? that on the agenda. Okay, so let's talk about... Let me do this. Uh, since uh, you use Arduino, so we'll talk about Arduino time. Uh, a couple of years ago, uh, Fred Decker helped me out a little bit. He's from the DCC++ EX uh, dev team also. Uh, with uh, the web throttle that they just introduced, and they just introduced uh, an easier way to install. And here it is right here. Without using... Uh, the Arduino IDE, you could just do it right from their website. You just plug it in and install it. Made it really easy. And that's when they first started using this Wi-Fi shield right here. I was able to get two of them. And after that, they were sold out for I don't know how long. Yes, a web throttle. Tell us more at Tom's Trains and Things. Yes, Heath, you're going to have to... Uh, I'll, I may look it up in a little while, but... Uh, um, I did a video about the web throttle, and uh, <laughs> I didn't know Nightbot made videos, let alone exclusive videos. Let me see. Yeah, now they can, but uh, two years ago, that's when I did I did a video on it, and uh, he even had uh, Anthony Williams. He's on the dev team, too. He's Dex, if you're on uh, uh, Discord, and... Uh, I had him on the live stream and he talked about, you know, things that were coming up on, on DCC++ EX. So I'm going to get back into it. Uh, you know, this is two year old stuff technology on here. So what I have to do is, uh, I have to read up because I moved. So I haven't been keeping up with what was going on with this, but it looks very promising. They're on version four. And there have been a lot of improvements in the last two years. And I'm excited. I got my... Is this an RD? Uh, well, on this one, I have a. I did this for testing. I got a Sun Founder Mega 2560. I got a Deke Robot Motor Shield. And then I got the... Whatever. Is this Maker Fab? Or I can't remember the name of it. But that's it right there. Let's get it in the light. I got the light right there. I, I saw the light. <laughs> there we go. There it is. So, I'm excited about doing it. Here's the getting started page. Let me bring this up here, right here. Boom. Everything you wanted to know about DCC++ EX, but we're afraid to ask. So there you go, getting started. And uh, let me put the link up in the chat so you can see it if you'd be interested in it. All right, there it is. DCC EXCOM get started slash or Kevin index. Smith. You still in here? Uh, is there anything on DCC EX that would get Heath excited or... Uh, a lot about a lot of other people excited about uh, using DCC plus plus EX. I know there's a lot of automation going on, so feel free to chime in uh, whenever you can. You you gotta get a lot of them in there. All right, here's and track manager will, will run both DCC and DC engine operation at the same time, up to eight districts A through H. All right. That sounds good. So that'll that'll keep the DC people. Hey Ray, 
you could you could run DCC plus plus EX on your layout. You could run your DC trains on there. All right, that's coming up in five, uh, version 5.0. Okay, good to hear. Okay, let me put this up. If you're interested in the new features of XRO and on the future track manager, look me up on DCCEX Discord. Or, or is it? Are you, you use the same name, or you do you use a different name on Discord? I know it kind of threw me off when Dex said his name was Anthony. <laughs> All right, Kevin, thanks for stopping in. I really appreciate it. Uh, I'm gonna <laughs> put that on my arduino in the next couple of days and probably uh put the word out that uh, how good it is thanks for stopping in and thanks for the information i really appreciate it and thanks for your hard work on the dev team you're doing a fantastic job there i've included a link to the dcc ex discord server in the description take a look at it at your convenience this is just a portion of the Monday night live stream. Make sure you tune in every Monday night at 8 p.m. on Tom's Trains and Things for more live streams so you can participate in the chat. See you there.